Hello and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today we have a special pit stop trivia quiz submitted by Janet and her husband. We've got 21 questions. All of the answers are song titles with like road or streets or avenue or boulevard in it. A perfect quiz to wrap up the weekend for Road Trivia. 21 questions, 20 up front, and then the tiebreaker at the end. Let's get started with question number one. In this song, Willie Nelson just can't wait to get where? Think of all the great Willie Nelson songs and just know that Willie can't wait to get On the Road Again. That's the title, On the Road Again. Question number two. Bruce Springsteen sang about these in the city of brotherly love. What is the title of this song? They're in the city of brotherly love. They are the streets of Philadelphia. That's the title of the song and the answer. Every answer will be the title of a song. Question number three. The 60s and 70s band America extolled the virtues of this Los Angeles freeway. What is the name of their song? They sang the song called Ventura Highway. Question number four. In this optimistic song of the 40s and 50s, you were in the daylight when you were here. Where are you? It's like a question about the song, but the answer is the title of the song. You are on the sunny side of the street. Question number five, the Beatles sang about this not so short nor exactly straight thoroughfare. What is the name of this song? That song was called The Long and Winding Road. Question number six, what famous Roy Rogers and Dale Evans song ended each episode of their show? The answer is Happy Trails to You. Question number seven in the song Easter Parade, first sung by Judy Garland and Fred Astaire in a movie of the same name, where did the Easter Parade take place? The Easter Parade on Park Avenue. Question number eight. In this Aretha Franklin song, she's riding in her pink Cadillac, where? She's riding the freeway of love. Question number nine. This Liberace standard from the 1950s was about where a feline resided. What is the name of this song? The name of that song is Alley Cat. Question number 10. Both Bruce Springsteen and the great actor Robert Mitchum sang songs with the same title. What are the names of these songs? Bruce, where he was taking Mary, and Mitchum, where he was hauling moonshine. The answer is Thunder Road.
question number 11. In what song by the Beatles about a Liverpool Emporium was there a barber showing photographs of every head he has had the pleasure to have known? The answer is Penny Lane. Question number 12. This great Ray Charles song is about a woman who has had enough of her partner and tells him to leave. What is the name of this song? The answer is Hit the Road, Jack. Question number 13. In his most well-known song, Roger Miller was known as what? If you know who Roger Miller is, and you know his most popular song, you'll know that he was known as the King of the Road. Question number 14. What is the song about a famous street in London where Sherlock Holmes lived, sung by Jerry Rafferty? The answer is Baker Street. Question number 15. Both Harper's Bazaar and Simon and Garfunkel sang what song about how to get over the East River in New York, where you'll need to slow down, you move too fast. That is the 59th Street Bridge song. Feeling groovy. Question number 16. When Dorothy was off to see the wizard in The Wizard of Oz, she sang about what path that she had to follow. The answer is The Yellow Brick Road. Question number 17. What was the title of the John Denver song that was about where he wanted to go and what would take him there? Where he wanted to go was home and what was taken there was Country Roads. The song was Take Me Home, Country Roads. Question number 18. What is the title song in National Lampoon's Vacation starring Chevy Chase. I believe it was actually written for those movies and a classic road trip song. The name of it is Holiday Road. I always expect to see a Ferrari pull up next to me when it comes on. Question number 19. Nat King Cole sang this song about this highway from Chicago to LA where you can get your kicks. What is the name of the song? Get your kicks might give it away. Since it's the first three words of the title, get your kicks on Route 66. And question 20, the Drifters and George Benson sang this song about New York's Great White Way, where the neon lights are bright. What is the name of this song? That song is called On Broadway. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia, and thank you to Janet and her husband for sending in an excellent, unique trivia quiz to wrap up our week. Uh, bad news is I did not plan far enough ahead, and I'm actually staying in Kansas one more week and I really only got trivia quizzes done through today, which by the time you're watching this will be Sunday. So we're just gonna have to take a little break. I have got a wedding next weekend, so I'm not going back to Ohio like I originally thought I would. So I won't see you again till next weekend. There will be no new trivia quizzes, and then I'll have to double up next week. 
uh, in order to get all 365 in before the end of the year. So sorry about that. Take the week off. Uh, get your house all decorated and ready for Christmas, and we'll get started uh, next weekend. Question 21 for today, though. In this song, the mamas and the papas sing about a place where nobody's getting fat except Mama Cass. What is the name of this song? The answer is Creek Alley. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia. Like I said, uh, don't be expecting a new trivia quiz tomorrow afternoon. I will not be back for a week, so I will see you in early December. I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving weekend. See you later.